Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Valerie Dyson and today we are going to be looking at this La Jaja palette. Um, I have this one in Glam Knot on my eyes today. I used three of the colors to make this look. Um, I used the color, I think it was a Sun Moon, this purple in my crease. And then I used the, you pronounce it Unfaitho Marble? I don't know. This color right here, and I put that kind of like the lid. And then I put on top of that color, Quiet, or Quiet Galaxy, that glitter shade right in the middle for like a halo effect. But yeah, we're going to be going over this one um, and... I'm going to show you what all they sent me because they do have more eyeshadow palettes and there was a liner, three makeup brushes in each pack and a lot of eye patches. So I'm going to show you that real quick and then I'll show you how to make this makeup look accurated using this palette, the purple one. And um, yeah, share my thoughts and opinions. So if you want to see that, then just keep on watching. I almost forgot to say, I was sent this, um, these three palettes or these three bundles um, for free to review on my channel. This video is not sponsored and I am going to share my 100% um, honest opinion. And I'm not going to, you know, lie to you in any way. I do. Okay, so we'll just get on to it. This is the palette I use today and it is the Glamour Not Lojaja, Lojur, Lojaja. I think that's how you pronounce it. Lojaja. Oh shoot. Lojaja. I don't know. But this is the brand. Um, thank you so much, Autumn, for sending it to me to review. Um, but yeah, so it is a very compact, like travel friendly palette. Um, it's just cardboard. It is cruelty free. You see the little bunny on it. Um, I chose purple just because uh, I looked last, looked last night to see other people review this um, and no one used the purples and plus I like purple and I like colors so I chose this one. Here is the colors and I do swatch um, the palette in a little bit but yeah that's that palette and what came in this pack was... All these eye patches plus one more that I used in this video and there's even a little instruction manual if you're a new newbie and or you want to get inspired but I just picked three random colors um, to make this look today but there is instructional sheets of how you can make certain looks on it like there's there's a few on there but I never look at directions so um, I mean, I looked at it, but it's just showing you what you can create with it, but I didn't use this one. Um, in the eye patches, you'll see me wearing it in a little bit. And it also came with a very good eyeliner. I think, um, I looked at the website and they are going for $9.99, what I saw, but I have heard anywhere, I think from $14.99 um, all the way down to, I think it was $7.99, depending on when you get it or whatever. So, but, um, this is the eyeliner and I will say, I love it. Like, it's really black. It went on, it went over this glitter, um, which not all liners can do that, but it's, it's a very good eyeliner. Like, I would pay 10 bucks just for this eyeliner, but you got um, also the three makeup brushes that came with it, and they're dirty because I used it for this makeup look, but, and the brushes, I like my brushes more, but it's, I'm going to keep them, um, but it comes with the bundle anyway, so it's like, it's good. I mean, you get an eyeshadow palette, you get an eyeliner, and a bunch of eye patches, with a shadow palette and brush it, I mean, $10? Mm. Yes. Yes, please. Um, but yeah, I don't really love these brushes out of the bundle, but 
um, in case you want a starter kit and you don't have brushes in your collection, this would be a nice bundle to get to start off and, um, you know, play around with the palette because, um, let's see, I use this, uh, mainly to kind of, you'll see in the flick me using them, but yeah, they're, they're okay to be in the bundle. I'm not mad at them. They were pretty good, but you'll see me using my brushes in my collection um, to make the eye look a little bit better and easier to make. As far as the eye patches, um, it's nice to have them. I've never really used these. Um, it is. It says it's used for eyelash extensions, but then it says in the um, like the description box on Amazon that you can oh by the way this will be linked down below in my description box if you're interested in getting this check out my description box um, I like it I definitely think it's worth it but this is only first impression but so far only $10 I love it I would I would buy I would recommend it. it's cruelty free great eyeshadow um, and the bundle, you can't beat it. Eyeliner itself is worth 10 bucks in my opinion. So, but they come with the gel eye patches. Like I said, each bundle came with that many eye patches. So it's a little bit easier because normally I do use a makeup wipe to clean off the fallout underneath my eyes, but I didn't have to do that with today. So it kind of you know, serve that purpose. It was pretty good. I liked it. I don't think I would go out of my way to buying them unless, I mean, it was really, really, really nice to have in the bundle, but I don't think I'll go out of my way to buy eye patches, but I do like, I don't know, I might change my mind after using this for the next probably month, these eyeshadow palettes. I might change my mind, but they're good to have and I'm really excited they was in the bundle okay since we got done with what comes in each bundle so you get that many eye patches in each bundle you get three br brushes in each bundle and you get an eyeliner in each bundle so since we got that out of the way I'm gonna go and show you the other two eyeshadow palettes that they offer all right so when you go to Amazon to order it um, it is going to give you a, a natural option, um, a brown option, and a purple option. And I forgot which one of these was which. Um, this is Glory Land. And I believe this is the neutral palette, but I could be wrong about that. But here's the colors. I've not swatched them or anything. I will be using this, these three palettes within the next month. So... If, in case you don't know, I do have an Instagram, and it is at Valerie Dyson, V-A-L-E-R-I-E-D-I-S-O-N, right here on the screen. In case you don't follow me, go over there and follow me. Um, I post pretty much twice daily. I might skip a day. I might do more in one day, less than another day. You know, but average, I think it's around two posts a day. But yeah, I'm going to be using these three palettes within the next month. Um, pretty much every day on my Instagram so yeah if you want to see looks of using this palette but here is I think the natural one if not the brown one and this one's called glory land again this one is memory mystery and I don't know you tell me what you think would be the brown and which one would be the neutral. There's these two palettes. So these are the other two that I did not use today on my eyes. One is called neutral, one is called brown. I can't remember which is which. Maybe this is brown and this is neutral. I don't know. I don't know which one is which. Um, but this is the memory, memory mystery, again, and this is the glory land. 
Okay, so more about the one I'm used today, um, the Glamour Knot that's on my eyes right now. The only three shades, I will say this Sun Mood, I can't remember. Mm. No, I didn't use the Sun Moon or Mood. I used Mystery Universe, Quiet Galaxy, and I think it's called Unfaithful O Mo Mar Marvel Mar Mobile. Unfaithful Mobile? I don't know. Whatever that is. So it was this shade, this shade, and this shade. And the Mystery Universe was very pigmented. Very, very pigmented. But it was kind of hard to blend. As you'll see in the um, clip. Um, Quiet Galaxy. Very impressive. Um, it went a lot better with my finger than it did with a brush though um so keep that in note um and then unfaithful un unfaithful mole whatever that color is called right there that color i didn't really like but like i said this is just first impression um it it took a lot to put on the lid to make it look the way I thought it should, um, but it wasn't bad. It just took a little bit more work. But overall, so far, it created this beautiful look and I'm really impressed with it. Only $10 for this palette and an eyeliner and a bunch of freaking eye, or eye, eye patches and three brushes. I think it's worth it. Especially since it's cruelty free, it's on Amazon. The descriptions in the description box, <laughs> yeah, the descriptions in the description box below. Check it out for yourself. Um, if you have any comments or questions, let me know in the comments below and I will try my best to answer them. But yeah, I'm going to show you the clip of me putting on my makeup now and yeah, come with you with the outro.
All right, that's the end of the video. I hope you enjoyed my makeup look using the, let's see if I can pronounce it, Lojaja palette. I hope I pronounced it right. Thank you again, uh, Autumn, for sending me these palettes, or these three bundles. I absolutely loved it, and I can't wait to use it more in my Instagram, um, in my Instagram videos within the next month with um, these other two palettes. And these are amazing price. I love that they're cruelty free. Um, please check them out, description box below. But yeah, I hope you enjoyed. Please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Blah, 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 blah. Subscribe. And I will see you buddies next time. Bye.